After praying with the family and blessing their home, all of us acknowledged there was a lighter feeling instantly. You could actually breathe now. But I knew it wasn't over. There was one more thing I needed to do. And the moment I stepped foot on the property, I knew the haunting of this family had everything to do with something evil that had taken place on this land years ago. I didn't know exactly what, but it didn't matter. I grabbed my holy oil and told them I had to do one more thing, and I walked out the door alone. I walked around the property, talking out loud to God and praying and declaring this home and this land free of all evil. I poured holy oil on the ground above the well that had been filled in. I commanded all demonic spirits to leave. I walked into the ran-down garage and began pouring oil and blessing it. Then suddenly I got a feeling of anger rush over me. Now I had their attention, and they weren't happy. I continued blessing the land as I walked away from the garage toward the road on the other side of the home. With each step I took, I felt more and more eyes on me, watching me. I glanced out into a field at the corner of the property. That's where they were. I couldn't see them, but I could feel them. Unexpectedly, my heart began to race. Out of the corner of my eye, I noticed a black shadow in the shape of a human. The same demonic shadow captured in the photo she showed me, watching her children as they played. Suddenly, it darted right toward me, closing the distance between us in the blink of an eye. I jumped back. I almost fell. My feet wanted to run out of instinct, but I stopped. I forced myself to stand and fight. I looked all around, but nothing was there. My heart was now pounding out of my chest, but this was why I came. After a few moments to collect my thoughts, I finished the prayer. Now focusing all of my attention on the one remaining demon possessing the home, clearly the most powerful one. This was the one that allowed the others in. As I finished the prayer and rebuked the spirit, I felt the heaviness lift. And as crazy as it sounds, though I'm standing there in the dark of night, suddenly I got a little bit brighter and the heaviness was gone. Though God used me to drive the demon away from this family's home and out of their lives, I couldn't keep it away. Only they could do that. It's their faith that would be tested next.